Can I be honest? I said, can I be honest? With less than two weeks before this audition submission, I opened the notes app on my iPhone while sitting next to my queen on our queen bed, and yet the insecurities of my abilities were the king of kings in my head and my heart, and I could hear that joker trying to jack my joy, so I began to write this poem out of fear because your eyes and, and ears are the, are the golden calves that subdue my impatience. A vacant and temporal hope I can worship, a fatal comfort I can usurp and distract me from my true worth and lay me to rest in a cute hearse. I began to write this poem out of fear because my initial writers, black, <laughs> felt like my final chopping block, uh, Cunningly clever cleaver, cutting off every nerve of affection for my savior, since my mind would rather belabor the point of your hypothetical opinions. Replacing each of your seats with a room full of pressing questions like, I wonder if they dig my outfit. I wonder if they think I stand out yet. I really need more followers on IG. I wonder if they search and found it. How am I sounding? Am I articulate? Is this crowd really feeling this? Is what I'm saying significant? Is this whole confession session just feeling like a run-on sentence without any indenty now? <laughs> Better um, pump the brakes <laughs> before they figure out my drive is to impress them. But I'm here. You're still. I'm still scared. All right. Um, relax. Recovery. Is your strong suit. Since your comments are usually off the cuff, just find a way to tie this clip back in. It's not like they know the lines anyway, and they're still engaged with the ring of this mic. If you just can't let them see you sweat while getting cold feet is what they expect. But whatever you do, just don't. Whatever you do. Snap! Out of it, Joshua! For the last two minutes, you have been mistaking the stage with a throne, thinking you could take the glory and leave me alone? Don't you know that I am a jealous God who refuses to play the background of your aspirations? Your pride could cut off you and pipe and leaving you aspirating. As for ratings, trash them. As for greatings, scrap them. The only way I say, hmm, my servant's well done is after I use my power to raise them. And you're saying, At the love of these people and the envy for these other poets is more delicious to palate even after writing and providing 66 love ballads that you've been having in your bloodline prior to conception. Supplying your parents with a passion for Christ movement in my direction. Don't you remember that my, my steadfast love was set when, well, before the foundations of the earth, which leaves no substitute for the lesson plans I have for you, says me, I am your worth. Which means these calves you are tempted to idolize will never have a leg up on me since they are my footstool. Joshua, why do you fear them? Them? <laughs> God, I, I'm just trying to use a gift, all right? I just want to make sure it's showcased with excellence. Joshua, please. Do not insult the creator who gave you intelligence, trying to embellish this and envelop this with a puff of smoke and reasons. Can't you see that's just choking on high treason? And you should know that your parents try to seize the trees when a slither turned into deceiving, even though I was present. So while you receive this present at the present, I care more about you believing in the EC descendant Jesus, who did not Count equality with, with you a thing to be grasped, but to submit it to your will to accomplish his task. God, please forgive me for this very moment, for, for cloaking my motives in a cozy coat of flesh, I confess. 
that my nerves burn because I have decided to, to turn from, from your son and, and run into an ocean of fickle attention. Filling my lungs with the words of mere men. God, God I began to write this poem out of fear, but I, I want to end it with a renewed faith in Christ alone to help me write now. My son, I love you, and you are forgiven. <laughs>